Hey coach, JJ Burden. Hey, I just wanted to jump on here for a second and say a couple of words, uh, thinking about you and, and thinking about the many lives you have impacted. And you certainly have impacted my life. I mean, I got all the memories right behind me and I reflect on them every day. And, and you played a key role in making this happen. Uh, I was thinking about kind of the start, you know, as as back in, in uh, 1988, when you drafted me, eighth round, 216th pick, uh, all 5'10", 157 pounds. And what was inter interesting about that was you obviously believed in me before I believed in myself because I did not think I could play in the NFL. And that's why I was so shocked when you're on the phone, hey, this is Marty Schottenheimer, head coach of the Cleveland Browns. I was like, what? You know? So, um, and I didn't have the most auspicious start, if you recall going to the mini camp and tearing up my ACL and, and in my pursuit of the, of the Olympics. But uh, it was that time on the Cleveland Browns as a, on the injured reserve when I truly started to believe that I could play in the NFL. And I appreciate the patience. I appreciate the times you, you came in there and talked to me in the weight room when I was all by myself. It was, all, it was just Redmond and I, and I was always rehabbing. And just the little things you said, and you said, hey, you're going to get your shot. You're going to get your shot. And um, I obviously didn't work out in Cleveland, and I got cut and got sent to Dallas. And Dallas told me I was, wasn't going to be ready, and they cut me at, right at the end of the season. But then you called again. You called again and gave me another opportunity. And I can't thank you so much because that year with the Chiefs in 1990, the off season, the training camp, it was when I really started to, I think, come into my own. And um, I did get cut, if you remember, I did get cut, but you said, hold up kid, I'm gonna get you on this team. Stay tight, don't go anywhere, give me two weeks. And I remember going back to my apartment, my wife, Raina, who was just pregnant and we were you know, didn't have much money and I called you after the second week on a Friday and I said Marty hey I, I gotta get a job I gotta do something my wife is pregnant I don't have any money he said kid hold up I'm gonna get you on this team and sure enough come Monday you called me you welcomed me to the team I played that following week and the rest is history and I go on to have a nine-year career and I can't stress how much um, I appreciate just the belief you had in me and really giving me a fair opportunity, not looking at me as a little guy that, okay, he's too small to play in the NFL. You, you one time said, you, got, you play with big heart, kid. You play with big heart. And I certainly tried to do that. But since now, being a motivational speaker and author, it's interesting because I consider you one of the more impressive motivators I've ever been around. I, can't, I can reflect on the many times where you said something before a game, during a game, after a game, where you motivated and inspired us to dig a little deeper and do more, give more, and be more. And I've tried to emulate that and share a similar message. But I remember a lot of your one-liners. You have a lot of good ones. And I use a lot of these in my presentations, such as one play at a time. And how about this one? If it's important to you, you'll find a way to get it done. And then I always love, men, the system works. You just gotta trust me, the system works. And then my favorite one, and I still have the t-shirt. Check it out. Take care of the little things. So these sayings, I use them every day. My kids have heard them. I use them in my presentations. But again, I just wanna let you know you're a huge inspiration to me. You made a huge impact on my life. And I wanna thank you, I wanna thank your family. And I just want you to know we're thinking about you. We're thinking about you and uh, keep your head up. And as you say, don't take it one play at a time. Just take it one day at a time. And no matter what, just always remember, stay positive. Thanks, coach. Much love. Take care.